He will be spending 28 years in prison, of course, but before Kwame Kilpatrick went away for corruption, the ex-Detroit mayor, his wife, his mother, and his mistress gave exclusive access to a Detroit documentary crew. 7 Action News reporter Jim Kurtzner has a first look behind the scenes of a film called The Real. Kwame Kilpatrick, take a look. Their journey with the former mayor started here, August of 2011. The father and son team following Kilpatrick out of his first stint in prison for the text message perjury conviction. His co-conspirator was his longtime friend who would be his chief of staff at City Hall, as well as his mistress. They're probably going to see a Kwame Kilpatrick that they've never seen before. Christine Beatty has not done any TV interviews until this. It was um, a loving relationship that regret happened because it hurt so many people. The same for Kilpatrick's wife, Carlita, still living in Texas with their three sons. Disbelief and anger and hostility and fear. Uh, a real wallet. All right. <laughs> <laughs> a moment of life outside of prison. Remember, he's back in again for a quarter of a century. Kwame talks several times throughout their two-year project. They say they got the real deal. The funny thing about it, after the family, his first love was Detroit. He's like, oh man, that just messed everything up. And how do they get so close to the Kilpatrick family circle where no one else was allowed? Tim knew Congresswoman Carolyn Cheeks Kilpatrick, Kwame's mother, from Washington, D.C. You know, it's going to be a non biased documentary. She didn't try to control you at all. None control of this message? Never, ever. She opened the door, let the chips fall. Let the chips fall where they may. She trusted us. The release of the real Kwame Kilpatrick will be sometime this spring. Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News.